I know. I know. I am a horrible YouTuber. I'm like the worst YouTuber out there. Wait. Logan Paul's probably the worst YouTuber, but I know I'm not that great. Hello, my fellow fat kid friendly folk. I hope you guys are having an awesome day. I about said awesome weekend, but it's not the weekend anymore. But I hope you're having a great day. Apologies upon apologies upon apologies. Can I take just a brief moment to kind of tell you guys how busy I've been? Just a brief moment. Let's, I don't want to take too long. The company I work for, they opened up a new office, okay? And it is like 70, it's about 70 miles from where I live. So it's in, it's a couple towns over. But my, the company I work for, they opened up a new office, so I have actually been working at the new office that takes me a little over an hour to get to, and I've been driving back and forth from there every day, so it's a long commute, late hours, trying to get a new office up and running, I'm just helping them with whatever they need help with, you know, getting this new office going, and I've even had to work Saturdays, like not every Saturday, but a couple, so... With that said, if I work a Saturday, that leaves me one day, like Sunday, to film a video, edit a video, upload a video, edit the thumbnail, all this good stuff, plus get done the other things that I need to get done on my, my day off, okay? So, I'm sorry, apologies, it's just been really, really hectic, working like long hours, okay? Don't hate, appreciate that I'm back! Okay, and I am back with a wish haul because I love wish hauls. <coughs> I got too excited. <coughs> Don't be an overachiever, Jojo. I'm excited about this haul, so excited. You know what this haul is about because it's in the title, but it's toys, toys from Wish, okay? And I'm really excited about it. I've had a couple people ask about wish hauls featuring toys, and I was like, yeah, yeah, I want to do that. I wanted to do it around Christmas, but then that's why I was like, ooh, Christmas though, Christmas haul. I'm gonna split it into two videos because I really want to be able to talk about these toys instead of just rushing through the items like I normally do to fit all of them in there. But I do have, I do have these two packages right here. About showed you my address. I have these two packages and I think these are from my Christmas haul and they finally arrived. I was going to open these. They're two that we can see what the heck they are and if they're Christmas, oh well, tis the season all year round, okay? Let's go ahead and get started on this video because I'm so excited. Like I said, there'll be a part two for the rest of them, okay? Okay, let's open one of the Christmas haul ones, alright? And I don't know where my scissors are, so we're gonna just kind of... This is well packaged. Oh my gosh. I got this for Christmas, and I just put it on. It has the thumb holes. Hello, emo high school days. Thumb holes. Oh my god. Anyway, sorry. I'm like a little ADD right now. I gotta get this bag open, and it's not working. Woo! Oh, it's a hat. Oh, look, it comes in like a little Ziploc bag. How fancy. Oh, we got a snowman hat. Look at it. Oh my God, it's adorable. Look at it. I don't know if it'll fit my big pumpkin head, but let's see. Oh yeah, that's, that's a ticket. You know, glasses and beanies do not go together. Yes, queen. Hello, what's going on? Just hanging out with my friend Frosty. What you guys up to? Mm, mm, mm. Yes. I like this, it's pretty cool. It's actually decent quality. Let me slip my hair. It's actually decent quality, it's really soft. It's like a really, oh, that's already falling off. Look at that, that's like coming off already. But this is really soft, like the really soft fleece blankets. I will link all of the items that I ordered in the description box down below, so I guess if you want them, you can go order them yourself. I don't make money off that, but I'll link them down below. 
Um, if I can find the link to this one, I will link this one, but this is adorable. I don't remember how much I paid for it. Let's go ahead and move on to something better. What is in this bag? This isn't a bag. That's not a bag. It's an envelope. Oh, I'm so glad these came. I know it's not Christmas, but I was so excited about this bubble wrap, bubble wrap. Don't you hate that new bubble wrap that like, has, I don't know, air holes already in it so you can't actually pop it. It just transfers to another chamber. That's so dissatisfying. These are amazing. I saw these and I knew that I had to have them. I'm trying not to talk over the wrapper. Oh my God. It broke. One moment. So let me just show you something real quick. These are the hooks that hold this thing together. And they are completely bent and broken apart. Well, they're not broken, but they're completely bent, like really badly. Let me see if I can um, get this back together, okay? One moment. I fixed them. These are amazing. Oh my God. I'm living for this right now. I don't know what this is. It looks like a weird tooth thing, but I'm totally wearing these at the next Christmas party. Oh, you best believe it. JoJo's rocking these bad boys. I don't care if I look stupid because I got glasses on underneath it. I'm rocking this. This, this is my life now. I need more of these in my life. This is amazing, okay? I think I spent like a dollar or two dollars on these. The link will be below, but this, it's amazing. That's enough of that, okay? Let me get into what this video is actually about. I've already wasted enough time. So what do I wanna open first? Let's open this. I don't know what this is. It just says toy. I, I don't know what this is. So let's see what toy means. Yay! Okay, so this goes back to my childhood. And of course, this is a lot smaller than I remember them being. But I don't know if anybody else remembers these toys. My 90s and 80s people, you know you have to remember these, all right? The little cupcake that, you know, magically transforms into a person. If this will cooperate. Look at her. Oh, Lord, honey, your arms. Uh, let's fix that just a little bit. That looks uncomfortable. You traveled all the way like that? Look! Now, this is a lot smaller and a lot jankier than the ones that I had when I was a kid. And it, is it supposed to smell like chocolate? I don't know what this is supposed to smell like. They did have a smell. She sorta of smells like chocolate, but like a very chemical chocolate. But look, she's still cute though. But the ones that I had were like much bigger and a lot better looking and they smelled like strawberries and cherries and I don't know, grape or whatever, but yeah, I think this one's chocolate. It almost smells like coffee, like a coffee chocolate. Mocha? Is your name Miss Mocha? I don't, I don't know, it doesn't say anything. But she also had this hat. Bam! She's got a hat, sorta. Bonnet, I don't know what you call it. This is my little cupcake person. She's really cute, I only paid like a dollar. At first, they were like, you can get the whole lot for a dollar and you thought you were getting this case like a whole case of them was like a hundred and some odd dollars. And I was like, no, I'll just take one. I'm on a budget. But she cute though. She's cute. I like her. She's got a gingerbread on the top. So I'm just really confused as to what this is supposed to smell like. I don't know. Gingerbread, mocha, chocolate, something. She's cute though. We like her. I'm pretty sure that I know what this one is because it's one of the larger items that I ordered. And it's very popular. It's very popular around Christmas. It's so difficult. Why are you being difficult? Okay, I paid like $13 for this, I think. About $13. The box is completely smashed. I mean, like, it's smashed. But this is supposed to be like a knockoff fingerling. I hate that name. That is the weirdest name to name a toy. Fingerling. Ugh, I hate it. But this is, I guess, a Chinese version version 
of a fingerling and it's a panda and I thought it was really cute and I paid $13 for it. It does come in the different colors right here, but I got your traditional black and white. So swing them, pet them, rock them to sleep, right side up or upside down. They love to panda around. Let's open this bad boy and see what it does. I mean, look at the box though. It's destroyed. I hope it didn't mess up the actual toy. But if this thing works, that's gonna be cute. We have instructions, just one little page of instructions. We have the toy itself. And we have a teeny tiny little screwdriver, a little teeny tiny screwdriver. It is a, is that a Phillips head? Like a tiny, yeah, it's a teeny tiny Phillips head screwdriver. So let's take little Ping Ping out. I don't know his name, but we're gonna call him Ping Ping. Oh, it's so, it's got some heft to it. It's cute though. Oh my god. So what do I do? After the boot, it will play with you. Don't drop, throw, or kick. Who is like drop kicking these things? Okay, let's turn it on. Ping ping! Oh my god. Okay. I don't know what it's doing. Calm down, ping ping, calm down. The arms move barely, but not really. So I have, I have fat fingers. All right, ping ping. Are you growling at me? It says to blow air. Tap his head. <laughs> I think I scared him. Okay, appar apparently, okay, pain, pain. Apparently he makes bamboo chewing sounds. Um, you blow air and it makes the sound of eating bamboo and shakes his head. Hang your panda upside down to explore his silly side. Press and hold both sensors on his head. Uh, cradle for sleepy. I think you blow a kiss. Like you can cradle it and it'll go to sleep? I don't know. Okay, so he's asleep and then I do this. And that scares him. Okay. Ping, ping. All right, that's enough of that. <laughs> that's enough of ping, ping. This is actually kind of cute. I, I mean, it might entertain a kid for a little while. From what I've seen, I don't know if the fingerlings actually learn phrases and things like um, Furbies like those do, um, but I'm pretty sure that's all that this does. It doesn't look too cheap, like a weird, crazy knockoff. Um, these are kind of soft and malleable, but this is hard plastic. I think he's cute. For $13, I ship it, not so bad. So I would recommend this. I think it's cute for 13 bucks. And like I said, they have these different colors right here. Purple, brown, blue, pink, gray, and the black and white. So, not too shabby. On to the next item. This is a very small something. A lot of times these don't say exactly what's in the bag, so you don't really know what you're opening until you open it. My glasses are falling off my face. Yes! I'm so excited for this! Yes! Okay, toys, toys, it's toys, just in case you weren't sure. But it's, ba -ba -ba. it's a Tamagotchi. Is it gonna focus with my face not in view? Is, is it gonna focus at all? Can I get some focus? Tamagotchi, this is a Tamagotchi. Hello, seventh grade. Oh my gosh, I used to have a cat and a monkey and I loved my cat so much. The monkey was really annoying because it made too many noises all the time. I'm so excited to have a time of gotcha. Oh my God, my childhood. Oh, oh, that's a little keychain. And it's pretty. 
It's orange and pink, it's pretty. Yay. Okay, okay. Ah. All right, let's do this. I never had a Tamagotchi. I had the Giga Pets. That's what mine were, the cat and the monkey Giga Pets. Oh, look at it. Oh, look, Ika Bunny. Oh my God, what do I do? Bunny rabbit, what do I do? It poop, wait, no, what does that mean? I don't know what that means. It's a bunny rabbit, and I don't know what to do with it. I, I don't understand. Like, it's got these icons. This is so confusing. Like, if you hit the reset button, it says 168 in one, and then I don't know what to do. Did it come with it? Oh, ahaha, uh ahaha. -huh, uh -huh. Let's read the instructions, shall we? I have been reading these instructions right here. They're teeny, tiny, tiny, tiny print. And I'm honestly just as confused as I was before I started. Basically what I've got though is you can hit this select button right here. There's apparently 49 pets. There's a chicken, a panda, a whale. I always wanted a pet whale. What else we got? The time. Crap, hit the wrong button. What the heck is that? What is that? Is that like a seahorse? What is that? A porcupine? Okay. A shrimp? Is that a shrimp? A sheep? A penguin! Okay, sorry. What am I looking at? What is that? I have no idea. Is that a, is that a child? What is that supposed to be? I mean, there's just a blob. A frog, a fish, a butterfly, a bee, a pig, a duck, whatever that is, a marmot. I don't know what, a fox, another dog, horse, bull, koala, elephant, snail. Everyone needs a pet snail. A crab, the moosin, is that a moosin or an elk, a dolphin, a bowl of cereal, an evil bowl of cereal, I don't know, a more festive bowl of cereal, I don't, I don't know what these things are, is that Patrick Star, oh my gosh, that looks like Patrick Star. And an evil person. And a, another weird person. They just, I don't understand the shapes of things. Is that a house? I mean, is that like, here, take care of a house? How does a house poop? Wasn't this like the OG Tamagotchi thing? Excuse me, my nose is itching. Is that like the OG thing? Is that Five Nights at Freddy's? Does that not look like Freddy from, or is that Freddy? I don't know, Freddy from Five Nights at Freddy's? What is that supposed to be? A pyramid? An umbrella? I need a pet umbrella? It's a dinosaur! It's a baby T-Rex! That kinda looks like Lego Bart Simpson. Does that not look like a Lego Bart Simpson? Some creepy man? Here, take care of this creepy man. And his creepy alien girlfriend? That's like an 18-wheeler truck. Why is an 18-wheeler truck a pet? I don't understand why that is an option. An army tank? An army tank. Oh, this is a pirate ship, come on. And we're back at Bunny. We're gonna go with Bunny. There are so many, there's 49 characters. Half of them you can't recognize, you don't know what you're looking at. The other half makes zero sense. Why do I need a pet pirate ship? Or a pet truck? What? And I'm pretty sure that was Patrick Star and SpongeBob in there. Which I guess, okay. Some of them just look like blobs, but um, I, I'm gonna have to figure out what to do with this thing. I don't know how this works. It's got all these instructions on what to do. So by the next video of the toy haul, Maybe I'll have more of this figured out, but I think it's going to take me a minute to really go through this and figure out how to use it because it's probably going to die multiple, multiple times. It's amazing though, when I think back, 
1997 whenever I had one of these and I thought this was the coolest thing on the planet. Of course, the graphics honestly back then on my Giga Pets were better than this. But it does essentially the same thing, I'm sure. I just need to figure it out. So by the next video, I'll tell you guys whether it's still alive or not and how to mess with it and we'll know more about it. I just don't have time to deal with that right now. All right, next item. I'm like in Tamagotchi world, so I'm like, huh? I was staring at that thing for like 15 minutes. We have a spiral graph. Is that what this thing is called? I can't remember what they're called. I just know that I had one of these growing up and I loved every minute of it. Let me take this out here. If any of you have ever seen one of these from your childhood, you know what they do, okay? I might not draw with it because I don't feel like it. That's what I do all day, every day in the engineering world is draft and draw. Basically, if you don't know how these work, you have these little spheres. Do they sit like in here? Ooh, they do. Check it out. They fit right there. But basically what you do is you take these little things right here. Oh, look, it's got like an arrow. Shoot, I could use this at work. It's got a ruler. Dude, anyway, sorry. You just take this and I, it's gonna be difficult to show. And I don't feel like moving my camera right now. It's just because it's a whole thing, all right? I'm lazy. But you basically take this, you put it down, and you stick your pen through this and you just like draw and it makes like spiral shapes and coolness. And depending on where you put your pen and the little holes right here, you get different shapes and, and different things like that. And I don't know if any of you had one of these, but I thought they were so cool and creative and I like it, I dig it. I think it was either free or a dollar or something very, very cheap. These feel a little, little on the cheap side. This really seems like your average quality ruler, but these do seem a little on the cheaper side. They're very, very thin right there. So they might stand up to the test of time, but I mean, it's like a dollar toy. What do you expect? But I ship it. Maybe I'll draw some designs and show it in my other video. We are down to the very last item for this video. We got more toys, never fear. But for this video, we're down to the last item. Isn't it exciting though? I kinda wanna start doing two-parters for these so I can take a little more time to talk about the product. And so just like, here's what I got and move on. You know what I'm saying? I don't know. I don't know if that makes any sense, but. Again, the same company, toys. So this right here is supposed to be a, like a children's watch thing. I thought it was like a smart watch. It looked like a smart watch. How much did I pay for this? Oh, it was free. It was free. Looking at the picture, it said, yeah, it says fashion smartwatch. Can I click on it? Will it do anything if I click on it? Smart music watch for child is what this says. So I thought that the screen was digital. Let me take it out of the wrapper so I can stop making so much noise. I thought that this was digital, but it, it's not. It's just like a, a screen. There's not even a protector. So what does this do? Okay, pull this out. Okay. Oh, okay, so the buttons do work, like. Okay, so here's what the front of it looks like. Will it focus? This is like a talking Tom. That sounded like a gunshot. So that turns it off because after sitting here and pressing this, it doesn't do anything. So this is an on off. And he sings every time. Oh, it won't stop. You all know that tone. So what does the guitar do? Sounds like drums. 
And then we have... Okay, um, I don't know if that's Chinese or Japanese or what. If anybody knows what language that is and what they're saying, could you let a person know? What if they're saying, it's a kid's toy. I was gonna say, what if they're saying something offensive? But no, I don't know. What does this do? A long voice message. Okay. That is enough of that. I have no idea what they're saying. If anybody can interpret this, let me know what this said at all. Just anything. Just let me know what they said. Oh, my nose itches. Well, that is the last item was that watch. So that is it for this video. I do hope that you enjoyed it. I'm running out of time on my camera right now. But I do hope you enjoyed this. Again, there will be a part two. Stick around for that one. There's gonna be more toys, more awesomeness coming through. I'm excited about some of the things that I got. I do like Ping Ping. Ping Ping's pretty cool. And my Tamagotchi. Again, if you did enjoy this video, don't forget to give it a big thumbs up. Hit that subscribe button so you can see more. Apologies, apologies, upon apologies. I'm sorry. I'm trying to get better at uploading on a regular basis, okay? Thank you to my loyal subscribers. I love you guys. Share my videos with your friends, family, loved ones, anybody who would enjoy the Fat Kid Friendly Family Experience. And I do hope that you guys, oh, Follow me on social media. I hope you follow me on social media. Description box down below. But most of all, I hope you guys have a fantastic day.